Hello, everybody, and welcome to another edition of the most highly anticipated stream of all time. How are you guys doing today? Hopefully pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. Just got back. Oh, yeah. So, so beer story time. We got to begin everything with a beer story because, you know, that's that's uh, that's where we are in our life right now is beer story. Anyway, so prepare for the dumbest story of your entire life. So, actually, first, how are you, Xavier? What's going on? Then we'll get to the beer story. <laughs> we'll get to the beer story after we, uh, we we catch up on everybody. How are you doing, Xavier? I'm gonna drink some coffee here. Sorry, I have like a prologue before I get straight into the uh, into the stories. You know, you know how it is. Yeah, wait for more people. I don't pay attention to how many people are actually watching. Like, mo you know, most of the time. <laughs> Every time I like, I, like I even quit like looking at like my my stream summaries most of the time because I look and I'm like, oh, yeah, it's like five people watching. That's good enough. <laughs> Just, you know, <laughs> only five people care. Yeah, that's right. Anyway, <laughs> what happened to the barn? Well, um, I put the vod up. You can go watch it yourself. So I decided to fight the second boss. That one really bad. Like, really bad. Like, I was extremely underprepared for this boss. <laughs> like, and, and so I respawned at, you know, the, the dilapidated barn, which is, you know, an, an, an indestructible structure at this point. Like, possibly a masterwork. And um, yeah, it kind of walked over and just, just crushed everything and murdered me. And then I went and I spawned a couple dozen, like maybe a dozen times more. Tried to recover my stuff, but then, you know, there's that also that that thing over there, that dude who can, like, one-shot us with an arrow. Yeah, he was over there, too. So, um, yeah, I was trying to fight the boss and that dude at the same time, and it went extremely poorly, especially since I basically ended up naked. So <laughs> so I convinced all, the, all of my new friends to destroy my bed, and then I just wandered back to where I was. And now I have a mace, and it's a good mace, too. I like the mace that I have. You'll see it here later. It's a good mace, great mace, um, possibly better than sharpened club. Well, now I have now I have spiked club. Yes, that's what I call it, spiked club. If sharpened club is, it's 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 a thing that'll be collected at a later date. Sharpened or spiked club is the way to go. That's what I'm saying. You know, this is this is what we do. I think I'm gonna light this thing on fire next time. I was grossly underprepared. It's basically a giant tree. It was very scary. I'm gonna drink some, I'm gonna drink some coffee here. So, so the barn is mostly, oh, it's, 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 um, it's a uh, stronger theme than what it was. Yeah, stronger theme. Now it is, dilapidated barn is now very deep into the dilapidation part of the barn. We'll be back, we'll recover it. I think that's one of the greatest buildings ever built in this game. We'll have to recover it. So anyway, but I got new things. I got new things tons of new things well some new things not tons of new things luckily everything that was important got lost next to the tree boss but we'll get it back we'll get it back eventually i had a shield and everything it was a good time it was it was absolutely a good time it just just didn't work out anyway <laughs> just just bad times all around i was i was not prepared you know how the first boss i went in there and it just couldn't do enough damage to even like stand a chance yeah this was like the opposite of that it was absolutely the opposite that boss is not messing around. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna do something stupid when I get over the next time. Just build a bunch of campfires. Just see if I can burn this thing to the ground. It might work. It might not. We'll see. That's that's an adventure. Probably not for this stream unless I get ambitious. Cause that boss is scary. Anyway, bang. Here we are. Looking pretty good. Looking pretty good. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna be updating my webcam. Or maybe maybe. I got a uh, an SLR. I or I no no. Um, got a good camera. I'll show you. Let me let me go get it real quick. Got a great camera. This thing's amazing. Been wanting one of these for like 15 years. Yeah. There we go. Oh yeah, look at this bad boy. Ooh. Yeah, this is good stuff right there. Actually, let's get in the game too. While we're here. While we're here. Might as well start up some Valheim. There we go. What brand? 
Well, people may be asking, it's like, Giant Thumb, why did, why did you go in and get a, get a, uh, get a nice SLRI camera uh, when, you could be, when you could be going and, you know, buying new computer parts so you can stream better? Why would you go and buy something like this? Well, I'll tell you why. I didn't. That's right. Welcome to the family of salvage. More salvage for our janky setup here. It's beautiful. Yeah, so, so yes, it's a Canon T3i. It's, it's you know, circa like, I don't know, like uh, 2011 or something like that. Absolutely free. It was sitting in Lost and Found for about eight months. And I said, hey, I'd like to have one of these. And they're like, sure, go ahead, take it. It's been sitting back there forever. Just let us know if there's any naked women on there. And I was like, ha, ha, ha. This is probably from a wedding or something, which it was. But there were also some naked women on it. Not, not like totally naked, like topless. But still, surprise, surprise. Anyway, hey, Carpenter's house going. Helicopter, you got it. You got it. They lost and you found it, that's right. Welcome to, and it come with a nice case. I just need, I just bought a charger for it so I can plug it in. It costs like, like 16 bucks. I don't know where I'm gonna put this. It's, it's, I can't put it on my whiskey bottle like my other one. So I'm probably gonna have to buy more accessories or set it on top of my subwoofer over there or move it over. I don't know we'll figure it out we'll figure it out anyway it's nice it's nice captures in 1080 we're good anyway helicopter oh, I don't know where it is. that was also loud it's down here that's right <laughs> that's right slowly but surely we're piecing it yeah it's very nice actually the battery was fully charged on this thing too but there were definitely naked ladies on here. One naked lady, actually. I'm gonna put this somewhere else because this thing's kind of like, this is about a $600 camera, so I'm gonna put this uh, right there. There we go. Or I can't possibly knock it over. Anyway, hey, Carpetless, what's going on today? There you go. But that should be arriving tomorrow, so I'm going to mess around with that tomorrow. <laughs> I'm going to mess around with that tomorrow. But anyway, where are we in Valheim? That's what we really want to know. Nobody's here to watch me sit here and rant and rave about all sorts of stuff. They're here to watch me get destroyed in Valheim. Actually, I may not get destroyed this time. I will get destroyed because I'm got reckless abandon. That's really what I left with. I thought, I, no, that's right. I didn't have enough to make pants. That's right. I forgot. We're, we're going to get back to, like, full armor. <laughs> for now. For now. Nudity-ish. I like how this game is like everything I don't believe in. Pants. Shouldn't even be a thing. But anyway, that's that's my cool thing. That's my cool thing. Found a, cool, a couple of cool stuff in there. I have uh, pants optional stream. That's right. That's always optional on this stream. Always optional. Before I got a webcam, I used to stream without pants on all the time. <laughs> now, I'm scared, which is why I put the thing over there. So, anyway, anyway, what are we doing? I forgot what we're doing. Probably. Oh, that's right. I remember what I'm doing. Kind of. Maybe. Just sleep. There we go. Anyway. I'm not, anyway, like I said, I found a couple of cool things in the, uh, in, uh, the Lost and Found. It just sort of sit there for a while. Like, after three months, it's fair game. Unless it's, like, really super pricey. Ended up with uh, a couple of really expensive pairs of sunglasses. Like, $200 pair of sunglasses. Got myself, like, some Oakleys and some Costas. Those are really nice. Um, found a really cool belt. So, I uh, I took it. Nobody else wanted it. Um, took it back home. And it was a, it was a, uh, it was a Versace belt. Yeah. Uh, Versace. So now I have a belt by Versace. That's very, very interesting and nice. Yeah, if you if you want to see just completely pointless excess, just go to the Versace website and look up and look up their Medusa belts, like the ones with the round buckles on it. That's the one I've got. That thing is obscenely expensive. How do people lose? I don't know. If I lost a Versace belt, I would be looking for that thing, but nobody seems to care. So now I have a Versace belt. It's not bad. I like it. It's I haven't worn it yet. It smells nice. 
Which might be kind of weird. It was somebody else's belt. How much is it worth? Well, this particular belt, brand new, is about $650. In fact, I will go and show it to you. I will show you all my, this is this Versace belt that I found. Behold, Versace, the most expensive thing that I own right now. Yeah, complete insanity. I'm going to throw it back over there on my, on my salvaged couch. But yeah, I, I got it and I was like, it's got a nice belt buckle on because it got like this like, hey, you can stop that right there. I'm going to have to beat you with my spiked stick. There you go. My spiked club. There he is. All right. Anyway, what was I doing? Don't remember. Oh, that's right. I was farming for wood. Yeah, completely. Anyway. Hey, Zena. How's it going today? Are you guys ready for whatever adventure happens to us today? Because I'm thinking, I'm thinking we either, we might do a little mining or we attempt to build an even bigger boat and go over here because we already went over here and I think with the right uh, right things we could possibly make this work. Or we sail off into unknown territory where we will get our butts destroyed. Handed to us even. Who even knows? I don't know. Because I have this nice little card over here. Which means I can technically load this up with mineral rolls and, and we'll have a good time. A great time. So many skull and bones on the right side of the map. Obviously, that's because where all the pirates were. I figured I'd watch you double the Valheim, double the fun. Can you, can you, can you duel Valheim? Is that even possible? All right, Senna. Your job, if you choose to accept it, is to play Valheim with your feet. You have enough hours, I think it's possible. That's what I'd be doing right now. That's what you should be doing. That's how America does it. I don't even know what I'm carrying around right now. Not very much. Do I have any... Nope, unresolved stuff. Nope, I do not. <laughs> yeah, that's where all the pirates are over there, so it's totally fine. Totally fine. Don't even worry about it. Full of coal, <laughs> but but yeah, there was a uh, a miss a miss happening. I, Senna, were you here? I think you were here, right? You were here when I took on that boss that we dare not talk about due to the thing. Oh yeah, that's right. I'm gonna make another pile of wood. Pile of wood, cause we need it. Yeah, that's right. Oh, that's right. You guys were here. Yeah, no, this it was the plan that worked out perfectly. Perfectly planned plan. That looks like it's going to be in the way. All of this looks like it's... Okay, well, can I stack this? Nope, that's an impossibility. I shall set you free right there. Ah, good enough. All right, good. That's good. That's good. We did it. We did it. That is exactly how that was planned. But yeah. So yeah, they can attest to the what could possibly go wrong scenario. Exa yeah, exactly, Carpentus. Right. Look, we just go in. <laughs> we go in. And horrible things were happening. That's where we go. All right, we did it. But I have a cart now. I'm quite pleased with my new cart. I'm going to put this... Actually, no, let's... My organization is terrible in here. I'm going to play stacks. There we go. Place more stacks. Play snacks. Nope. Do I, do I can play snacks? Yep, there's some snacks I can place there. Yes. Play snacks. All right. So what do I got? I got some pants, some honey, and some shrooms and some coal. I'm going to put the coal into... Here, this will be my coal chest. As you do, the rocks shall go in there too. Great. 
I had a dilapidated barn over there, and it was great. I love that thing, and now it is gone. And I am a sad panda because of that. So, this is going to be stupid too, isn't it? This, this is going to be bad too, isn't it? Oh, yeah, this is... I'm not sure we're saving time doing this. Just saying. Can I fight while I'm dragging this thing? Oh, yes. Listen to these cart noises. This is amazing. Also, I want to compliment my ass. I mean, look at this ass. All extra things we find, they go in the cart. Because that's just how we do things over here. Oh my god, this is the worst. <laughs> Can I run? Yay, I did it! Alright, let's get our shroom up here. That worked. Oh, this is... Oh man, nope. I don't... Jump. God, why is this terrible? I don't think this is a long distance cart. This feels like a short distance cart. We can do it. I'm trying to get some more mineral moles. Wait, do I have everything like fully decked? I do. Okay, good. Other than my axe, which is partially destroyed, everything else is fine. But anyway, what are you guys up to today? I have a story related to beer. I'm going way too far south, but I, I can't quite go the other direction. this way into the blackening forest so anyway there's this brand of beer that i like it's a nostalgia beer you know you, you got to drink this like nostalgia some people it's like coke or pepsi or you know i don't know like 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 hawaiian punch or whatever you guys drink i don't know you know you used to drink it when you were like when you were like younger and you got like you know nostalgia for it mine is mgd beer I've been drinking this stuff since I was in high school. Unless you ask my parents, in which case I drank it specifically starting when I was a legal drinking age. But, uh, anyway. I got a hankering for it. Like, uh, man, like, uh, like a while. Oh, this is not great. This is stupid. I should not be taking this cart over here. I feel this is going to take longer than just... Oh, downhill, though. Downhill's good. I like downhill. Oh, this one right here. It's perfect. This is exactly where we need to be. How do I detach from this thing? There you go. Okay, good. I could eat another bite. You're right. I could eat another bite. Anyway, where was I? So I've been, like, looking for this beer around here. It's MGD. It's, made, it's Miller Genuine Draft. It's great stuff. You know, it's sort of like, it's not like a super fancy beer. It's just, you know, like, it's just a regular lager. Um, couldn't find it here. Searched for like six months. Couldn't find it at all. So I eventually I started just asking like people at these at these liquor stores I was going to because I spent like hours looking for it. Hours. And they were like, oh we don't sell because it, it doesn't sell well here. Okay, no problem. Fine. Guess I'll just give up. Anyway, I was at Publix the other day, and it was just sitting there. Without even looking, I bought it. And my god, that stuff's expensive. Like this beer, it was $17 for 12. Absolutely insanity. I bought it anyway, because who knows when I'll see it again around here. And that's my beer story. So actually, that goes with like two things that I find here, that I like, that I barely find here. There's also my favorite coffee, which is Chase and Sandburn. Uh, which is very popular up north. Can't hardly find it around down here either. So I bought that. When I see it. I found it here like a couple of times. And I buy it every single time. Like there's a, there's a, there's a really crappy supermarket like maybe like 10 minutes down the road. Yeah, maybe, maybe 15, I don't know, 10 or 15 minutes down the road that sells this stuff every once in a while. Where's here? It's it's in Florida. It's in, a, it's in a city in Florida.
That's where here is. So that makes two things that I've only seen here a couple of times. Yeah, 17 bucks was kind of steep. And that reminded me why I don't really drink that much anymore. Not because I don't like a nice beer. It's that I can't afford it half the time because it seems like it's a ripoff now. Granted, there is Rio beer, which has the most astoundingly solid box I've ever, ever picked up in my entire life. But that stuff is super cheap. And again, you only find it every once in a while. Well, I heard you. Nobody's attacked me yet. That's kind of weird. Got some of that. Hey, dinner. How's it going? My stuff on a global network of computers. Just imagine. Well, I do that for coffee sometimes, but I, I'm not going to start ordering beer online. <laughs> that would be weird. Granted, going ordering coffee online was kind of weird. I feel like a hipster when I do it. Oh, am I full? Can I use the cart? You moved away from Florida? I did it too, and then I moved back. <laughs> you fool! Put all this in here. Might as well put all these rocks in here. There we go. Eat some bloobs. <laughs> Speaking of, I was I like so I so I discovered a while back that there was that there was that oh it broke! Damn it! Let's mark this. You know, I'm gonna be smart. I'm gonna mark this on the map. There we go. Uh, cart. I'm gonna mark this on the map. Go back to my thing. Fix it up. Come back. Smart. Sometimes I think I should move. I I'm probably gonna get priced out of Florida. Eventually. Everything's getting really expensive down here. For no reason. Other than the fact that tons of people are moving here. I moved here before it was cool. But anyway. Back to the Mountain Dew story. So I found a... I found, like... Discovered Flaming Hot Cheetos Mountain Dew. I've never heard of this stuff, but I feel this is something we need. Desperately. Yeah, I know it's going to be gross. It's going to be... It's going to be gross like a fox. Well, whatever that means. Sounds disgusting. It, it looks disgusting. But it's such a running gag now. For the people who weren't here when I was playing My Summer Car. A lot. Like, a lot, a lot. There was a lot of Cheetos gag. Not gagging on Cheetos. But there was the, there was the inside joke with the Cheetos. Should try and issue my... Exactly, we should. I'm, I'm going to get it. I'm going to wish I didn't spend the money. This is, this is what your donations and subs are going for. It's absolutely something your donations and subs go for. It's just, it's just going to be buying... Oh, you guys. Get out of here. You too. Oh, I missed. It's fine. You can try it after try. I will. I will. It's 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 going to be terrible. But I'm comfortable with that. I am not very far away from my house. I thought I was farther away. It's working out. There we go. Oh, got some of that. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at all that gold. It's not gold. Definitely not gold. But yeah, it, it looks disgusting. But we, we survived the flaming hot, the flaming hot Cheetos mac and cheese. So, <laughs> what are the odds we can we can live through the other stuff? Hopefully, pretty good. Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Wait a minute. I didn't realize I had this much. There we go. All right. It's the ore. It's the ore. There, that's not quite what I wanted to do, but that's okay. That's close enough. In, on, it's fine. Both of them work perfectly well. Oh, wait. I was going to put coal in there. That's right. Coal. Uh, play stacks. There we go. Got it. Nailed it. All right. Good. Like, see, they can make flaming Hot Cheetos Mountain Dew, but they won't combine the magicalness of Doritos and Mountain Dew and create Doritos, Mountain Dew-flavored Doritos. 
It seems like it's a no-brainer. Get out of here. That's a terrible hobby for that guy to have running up and then dying. I know, right? And I don't even think that Doritos would be that bad tasting. It would just be like cussing loud here. Yeah, you know, as long as it's not overboard. Absolutely. I don't care. Absolutely. See, see, this is my billion dollar, you know, like, like idea right here. And it's, and, and I would, I mean, people would buy the crap out of that. Like, tell me, like, if you like Mountain Dew, to even a small extent, you would probably try Mountain Dew flavored Doritos. Now, now, Doritos flavor Mountain Dew, I'm not sure about that. Because that really is going to come down to, like, two things. Either cheese flavored Mountain Dew or, like, ranch flavored Mountain Dew. Both of which are degrees of disgusting. Probably the ranch flavored Mountain Dew would be slightly more disgusting. But yeah, Mountain Dew flavored Doritos. I mean, that's just, that's just basics. I didn't fix my pickaxe. Why am I even doing this? Didn't fix my pickaxe even a little bit. <laughs> Never mind, got sidetracked. Doritos will do that to you every time. But that's the kind of stuff that we need, that, that they need. I refuse to die until they give me my freaking Doritos. I will be 187 standing out fry outside of the, uh, I don't know who'd be in charge of making Doritos. I'll say PepsiCo. PepsiCo. Yeah. Give me my Doritos so that I can taste the sweet, sweet flavor of death. Finally. That's what I'll be saying. No, I have no choice. I mean, like, there's some crazy immortal guy just standing outside screaming about Doritos. We might as well do this. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. That's what I was looking for right there. We did it. Yes. But I could go on and on about how Doritos should be absolutely the best thing in the world. And I want them now. My gratification should be instant, just like the coffee I'm drinking. <laughs> not even going to apologize for that joke. That was a terrible joke. No, that was a great joke. I'm, I'm not apologizing for it now. No, that was a great joke. Everybody had clapped and howled with laughter. That's what, yeah, yeah, yeah. I could tell. Anyway. <laughs> anyway. So, yeah. We need, uh, yeah, I'm definitely going to be, at some point, going to be buying some, uh, and uh, so, some um, flaming hot Mountain Dew. The worst part is, most of the stuff's going to be horrendously expired because they only released it two years. They mis released it in 2021 and 2022. So I'm going to try for the 2022 stuff, and mostly because it seems like it's less expensive, but also because it'll be less horrendously expired, which I don't feel like contracting some sort of horrible Mountain Dew Cheetos derived food illness I mean it would be funny it'd be funny for everybody because they just you know like it's it's something that everybody would expect the Pocky one ship challenge yeah I might do that and shit nightmares that's what it's all about it's not so much about dying on stream it's, it's about shitting nightmares <laughs> Not, not shitting nightmares on stream, though. That would be... That's a whole... The, go to my only thumbs account to go and watch that. So have you done the... Pie? Anybody down here done, like, the one chip challenge? Do a sub challenge? Oh, yeah. I could. This year... That's, that's, what, that's what I should do for Halloween. The one chip Halloween challenge. Instead of eat shit, it'll be eat, eat chip. Playing jank games that we find on suspicious websites. And eating chips. That's what it's 
it's all about. So that's America right there. For the Hot Ones Challenge? Oh, I tried. My friend, uh, he subscribes to the, uh, the Hot Sauce of the Month Club, where they send him like five different hot sauces every single month. And he can't give these things away. Like, I've got ten hot sauces from his collection over here. But, uh... But they went and, uh... Evidently, the the last dab is too mild now. So they invented... They, they created something called Pepper X. The bomb, the bomb is... Yeah, the bomb's pretty hot. Pepper X. I can't remember what the stuff was called. But it's not the bomb. It was like one of their alternative ones. We had that and man, it was nightmarishly hot. Like I like spicy food. Don't get me wrong. Uh, there's uh, this company called Blair's. Blair's Hot Sauce. Blair's Hot Sauce uh, is great. They make my favorite hot sauce of all time. Blair's After Death Hot Sauce. Absolutely delicious. The perfect mix. It's like a spicy Chipotle style heat. It's df licious. Highly recommended. Stop it. Oh, these things just hate. Me. I don't know if I should be able to leave my card out here. Idiot. There you go, got him. Easy. A little bit too easy, if you ask me. But, uh, Blair's After Death Hot Sauce. A, it's delicious. B, it comes with a keychain. I would really like to chop some freaking rocks here, please. Instead of having to deal with you guys all day. It's fine. A little upsetty spaghetti. It's been worse. I don't know. Do you guys, are you guys interested in hot sauce? Do you guys like hot sauces? My kind of like go-to one most of the time is just uh, Louisiana hot sauce. I don't know what it is. It's it's like, it's pretty perfect. Oh my God. Will you knock it off? I'm trying to get some work done here and you guys are just being a bunch of dill holes. Trying to chop him. Oh my god, get out of here! I didn't even see you back there. Jeez. Where these guys are coming from? Just trying to get some deposits here. Like the flavor, particularly spicy ones. See, yeah, exactly. I like, you know, I like them both. But most of the time, I just get Louisiana sauce. It's usually enough for me. A nice, nice sort of flavor profile. Uh, it goes well with everything, pretty much on macaroni and cheese. Actually, there's two foods that are a better uh, vehicle for Louisiana hot sauce. One is mac and cheese. Uh, the other one is uh, Totino's Pizza. Those little cheap, like, 50 cents pizzas that are barely pizzas. They're only there for Totino's hot sauce. Or for, for Louis oh my god. You know what? Just don't hit that thing. You guys are going to make me mad. Run away, because I'm... St oh, crap. All right. Okay, that was... that was. You know what? We're going to eat some beef. There we go. And, yeah, that was great. I'm going to just kind of run away now. I don't think I should be out here at night. I'm not I'm not dressed for it. Next Tabasco. Oh, yeah. Tab oh, the Chipotle Tabasco. The green Tabasco. And the Chipotle flavored Tabasco. Are amazing. As long as it's on a raw oyster, it does. That it do. Also, one of the things I never used to eat until I came down here. Like, there's a number of things. One was raw oysters, because I lived in Illinois, and those things are, A, kind of expensive in Illinois, and B, you know, they just, they just don't make them, eat them very much out in Illinois. Uh, B was soft shell crab. That was a little bit weird. Delicious, but weird. Sitting down at the table, got some bunch of pile of soft shell crabs. You're like, so I'm supposed to eat the entire thing? Yes, you're supposed to eat the entire thing. Okay. A little weird. And uh, also crawdads. 
Uh, never, never ate those in Illinois, but I ate them here, and uh, they're delicious. A lot of work, but delicious. All of which Louisiana, Louisiana hot sauce go extremely well on. More than eating regular crab? Really, really. I mean, it's it's easier. You just eat the whole thing. Also, hey, Bricar, how are you doing? On this episode of Naked and Afraid, <laughs> we did... I'm just standing around and do this. Not a fan of spicy stuff? Yeah, I, I like spicy stuff. I'm not a fan of what happens after I eat spicy stuff. But, you know, the regular spicy stuff, it, it'd be pretty good. Get out. I hear that thing out there. I will murder its face so hard. Maybe there's nothing out here. I don't know. Why am I standing in the rain? Let's get out of the rain here. Hee <laughs> hee. Secret aardvark sauce. I don't know what that is, but I kind of want it. Like I said, my friend's got it. My friend has a, uh, belongs to the Hot Club of the Month Club. And he's probably got like a hundred and something odd hot sauces. I, I have about ten of them sitting here. Ooh, habanero. Ooh. Habanero is delicious. I would say habanero in the right, in the right sort of. I just opened that. I don't need to be in there. There's rocks. There's stacks. There's stacks. 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 Puke berries. Who could ever love puke berries? Stacks. Close up here. I might as well make some. Make some more jerky. Only one? I, oh, well, well, there's plenty of honey out here. I think I'm probably not at a loss for honey. Hey, bees. Thank you for your donation to the cause. More jerky. There we go. Excellent. Well, that's what I like. Oh. Almost made wood arrows. I don't need wood arrows. Got him. Time for bed. But yeah, there's, there's no longer the last dab. is not the hottest one on hot ones. It's some sort of like stuff made with pepper X, which is a hybrid pepper. And oh my God, is it spicy. I had one on a Cheeto. Because you know, when you're, when you're watching football with the boys, as you do, eventually you start making up stupid dares for each other. Hey, when the, when the, if the, if the Bears, like, score a touchdown, you have to eat a Cheeto with the super spicy hot sauce on it. Okay, deal. If the Bucks go and score a touchdown on the Bears, you have to eat a Cheeto with a bunch of high spot sauce on it. So, of course, you know, the Bears are sucking this year, so ate a Cheeto with, a, uh, with some hot sauce on it, and it was very spicy. Absolutely abysmally spicy. It was quite... Spicetacular. It was it was one of those tears running down your face, sort of like spicies, like spicies. But the good news was it was gone in like five minutes, which is nice. Definitely not the hottest stuff, the hottest stuff I've eaten. But uh, it was it was it was, it was a little it was a little tingly. It was slightly tingly. If you played a game that is not the one, may I ask if you played a game that is not the one you are currently playing? I, if if I played a game that is not the, I mean all the time. I mean, every game I've played other than this one is not the game that I'm currently playing. Oh, a game you specify? Yeah, I can do that. I mean, like, yeah, yeah. I mean, I take suggestions all the time. English art, okay. <laughs> I was like, there's a trick question in here. Carpets has been talking on Discord to everybody else that's here. And they're making me do, they're going to make me do something crazy. Yeah, yeah, if you if you would like to see us the game, yeah, go for it. I am 100% down to clown, as they say. Barotrauma. I have not. I don't even know what that is. 
Sounds great, though. 14 beef. Gave me some jerky. I'll eat this jerky. Sure, it's foggy. What is that about, anyway? Is that a simulation of some sort? I've never heard of bar barotrauma. That's how you say it, right? Barotrauma is a barotrauma. Like barometer, is it like barrel? Any more delicious, delicious stuff? And there's a, I mean, there's a little bit. There's, there's a smidge more over here. Copper deposit. Yep, I have a clean house. Get all this copper. Got it. Got it. Submarine simulator. Ooh, that sounds fun. Also, it sounds incredibly like it's going to be dead. A submarine thousand meters deep in the Europe in Europe with aliens and mind control fungus permanent design. I'm on. I'm in that. That sounds amazing. That sounds amazing. Add it to the ever growing. All right, I heard that. You guys are assholes. Get out of here. Just trying to mine. I'm getting really tired of the miniature tree too. Have it on your account? Oh, okay. Yeah, sure. That sounds fun. Europe is in a moon of Jupiter. Oh, Europa. I thought I misread that. Europa. Ah, okay. All right. Yeah, that's the one where like all the water that's under the ice. Yeah, okay. I, I get it. Yeah, no, that'd be funny. I'd like it. Sounds a lot like Florida. No, Resident Evil 7 is Florida. I should play Resident Evil 7 as a as a joke Florida stream. Alright, I think we got it all. Let's just uh, hook ourselves back up to this and head off in a different direction here. Find ourselves some more stuff. Not in the right position. There we go, got it. Alright. RE7, yep. RE7. I haven't played it because I've already I've already played that. I played that like a long time ago. I never streamed it. I streamed RE8 though, and I bought our Resident Evil 2. So that'll be super fun for next month here. RE7, yes, our Resident Evil 7 is like Florida. Have you have you seen it? It's you're you're in a swamp with rednecks. It's it's practically Florida. With zombies, we've had zombies here. Bath salt. Do you remember the bath salt pan er, epidemic? Oh, hey. There's more. Detach. Relocate map. Using M. Cart. Okay. You played all the RE main games? Ooh, nice. Which one's your favorite? I've, I've played Resident Evil 2, like the OG one. Resident Evil 4, the, the OG one. It's the worst, and I thought if it's like RE7, hey, 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 look. <laughs> it's worse. It's so much worse. I don't dare go outside. People think I drive like a, you know, I keep telling people I drive like a 2012 Chevy Cruze. In reality, it's one of those school buses with, like, armor and spikes on it just to get to work. That's what I really drive. Yeah, I played Resident Evil, the original, or original Resident Evil 2, the original Resident Evil 4. Then the last, next one I played was RE7. And then RE8. And then I, no, no, I also played Resident Evil 1, too. Never played six. I never played six. Never played six. I hear it is El Terrible, as they say in Espanol. But who knows? That's right. That's right. I forgot. I played like the uh, HD remaster of Resident Evil 1 on GameCube, which, which I completely believe is the best version of Resident Evil 1 you can buy. Like no competition. A lot more fun in co-op. Ooh, I have no idea. You know what game I want to play in co-op? Uh, Dead Space 3. I've already played it, but I never played it in co-op. 
Looks really fun. Yeah, RE7, RE7 was really fun. I really like that one. That was a nice return to form. Resident Evil 8. Oh, it's broken. It's broken. Time to add some more of this to the thing. Let's add some more of this and some more uh, play stacks. There we go. All right. And what else do I want to add in here? Yeah, might as well add this wood. There we go. Sure. Best remake is RE1 remake. Oh, that's just the remake again, which I would think would be. Yeah, I mean, the, re the, the HD remake for Resident Evil 1, I haven't played the PC version. I played the GameCube version, and it was fantastic. Like, they, it, it's it's just what you want. It's like, it keeps exact. the game is exactly the same, I think. I never played the original original. But everything is just really nice. They redid all the artwork for it. Supposedly added, like, a bunch of new stuff into it. Having never played the original again, couldn't really tell. Tank controls. Yeah, tank controls are extremely janky. Um, also, the fact that stuff can attack you off screen and you can attack stuff off screen is also kind of weird. I'm not saying that there was a lot of... That there's, like, a lot of, like, super good ideas going on in that game all the time, but it's, you know, it's not bad. It's a mushy mush. They expanded the story? Yeah, that's what I thought. I also... Heard that some of that the red zombies, the one that's come back to life, or come back is even stronger or whatever. Those were new too. Which is a great addition. It, it added some unpredictability. Which I like. So that that one was good. That that one was one I think everybody should play. Yeah, Crimson, there we go, not red zombies, Crimson. Yeah, that's that's what I meant to say. Yeah. <laughs> Crimson zombies. Give me your delicious pork. Explodes into pork. Expect all pigs to explode into pork now. Pork explosion. Anyway. <laughs> but yeah, that, that game was fantastic. 10 out of 10. One of the best games I think they ever made on GameCube. Add some stacks. Add some stacks. The repad. More stacks. The more stacks. The repad. More stacks. Maybe. Uh, I want to keep my jerky. Let's see. Play stacks. Boop. There we go. All right. About you, is there anything in here I want to do? Nope. Wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. Double pants? Hey, double pants. Nobody look at the fact that I had double pants. Double pants is not no bueno. Add some jerky, there we go. Delicious. But yeah, so I bought so I bought Resident Evil 2, which we'll play next month here in the spooky month of Spooptober. I'm excited about that one because that game looked looks really good. So does the Resident Evil 4 remake, honestly. I think the Resident Evil 4 remake looks fantastic. Resident Evil 3 looks pretty good. I heard it's the weakest out of the uh, out of the remakes. That's how manly I am. I just punched a pig to death. The Ada, the, the Ada DLC, really good. Three makers too short. Ah. Yeah, it looked like they skipped a lot in Resident Evil 3, but I don't know. Yeah, I haven't really looked into it. I just looked at it and was like, yep, this looks like more Resident Evil. I'm in. Turn it off before I spoil something. Never played Resident Evil 3. Also, I never played the uh, the Ada DLC for Resident Evil 4. So that would be totally new. The Ganador. Or again, use my epic Spanish skills. 
Xavier knows about my epic Spanish skills and how accurate they are. Me gusta pantalones. The greatest Spanish pickup line known to man. I really wish that was a deposit, but it's not. I gotta go back over here and do the thing with the stuff. Right on the end. Oh, you knock it off. I just don't care. Just trying to get some work done over here. So aggressive. You'd think they'd be a stink by now. I didn't chop that tree. I didn't stop the light the fire. Anyway. I was able to. Looks really good. I'm excited. The, the, the recent Resident Evil game I, I kind of didn't like. Well, I liked it. It was Resident Evil 8. I don't know. Like, the more I think about it, the more I'm just sort of like, that was, like, like, oh, who was the main character in that? The main character is, like, the worst main character of all time. He is so stupid. But, man, can he take a hit. <laughs> The main character in Resident Evil... Ethan, yeah. Ethan is a terrible character. Yeah, Ethan in 7 and 8. Yeah, he, he is a terrible character. Eight more than seven? See, I was the opposite. I like seven more than eight. Like, eight was... Eight was like... It, like, it, like... It gave the, the... Eight gives you the illusion you're exploring... But it's really not. Whereas seven, like there's, there's more exploring. I guess. I guess I don't know. It's, it's hard to explain. He did have more personality in eight than seven. It's true. <laughs> that is true. But he's definitely out of the Resident Evil uh, main characters. He is definitely the worst, in my opinion. Your mileage may available. Everybody else owns no. Everybody leaves. Ethan was a Ethan was a hero. Oh, seven was too scared. Man. Embrace it. Embrace the spoops. Everybody embraces. Go play some amnesia the dark descent. Killed everything here. Now time to get back on the cart. So I enjoy I enjoy scary games. Problem is if I play too many of them, then I get burned out on them, and they are not as effective anymore. Oh, stop it! Can't you see I'm desperately dragging this cart around looking for resources? Stop it! Oh my God! You want? Is this how you want to live your life? Is evidently. Trying to drag the cart around things over here, trying to nibble my giblets, and not in the good, fun way. In the bad way. Oh, this cart's gonna break, and I'm gonna be having stuff all over the place, isn't it? Uh, if I were a deposit, where would I be? Down here? Maybe. That looks up. Oh, that, that's a cave. Have I been in this cave? I don't know. I don't need anything in that cave. Get out of here. Bush. Need another bite? I could need another bite. Have played Phantasmia or De Demonologist? I haven't. No, no. I've seen some of that. I have seen some of that. It looks fun. That's the problem is I have like... like who threw stuff? Somebody threw stuff. I saw... It, oh, I'm stuck in the air. Kind of. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh, I'm stuck! Oh, how do I do? Oh, I say I open the thing. Ow! 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 There you go. Okay, got it. Yeah. No! Cart! Okay, cart. Woo! The good scare. Oh, that's what I heard. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I mean, I'm more of a single player spoop type of person. Which is why I didn't get, um, uh, what was it? The, 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 the crap. What's the name of that game? 
It was the game where you had like the camera and running around to part the insane asylum. I can't remember the name off the top of my head. It's getting harrowing in here. Give me some resources. Give me some resources. Here's some tin. I'll go get some tin. That makes sense. Outlast, yeah, the Outlast Trials. I was really hoping that would be a single player game. Because I really like the Outlast Trials series. It's fun. Okay, fine. We'll just go down here. There we go. Let go of the cart. There we go. All right. No, no cart. Bad cart. Yeah, that last trials looked really fun, but I was really hoping that would be like you know, single player. I also don't hear much about that game either. So what are your guys' favorite spoopy games to play at Halloween or other times? Quite a few. Dead Space. I heard the Dead Space remake is really good too. Not sure if I'm going to get it though. I, I've played the crap out of Dead Space. Until Dawn. I kind of like that. Yeah, Until Dawn was fun. That game was fun. I, had to, I gave that back to my friend though. Has a creepy vibes in the series. Yeah, that's true. I, I haven't played DMC 1. I played DMC 2. Or do you, no, was it three? No, three, that's right. I played three, not two. Ah, it broke. Yeah, boo. Boo. Okay, let's just leave this cart here. Two is bad. That's what I've heard. That's what I've heard. I, I never played one. I just went straight in for, uh, straight in for three. Draw the cart, storage. Throw that in there. Might as well throw this in here. Play stacks. Bango, bingo. Get in there. There we go. All right. Now, as long as it doesn't break, we're fine. Actually, you know what? I think I'm going to repair this cart. Yep, definitely needs that. Definitely needs that. Oh, I need a crafting station. Oh, man. Okay. I have to build one of those sometime. Oops, wait, wait, wait. Mark it. Mark it. Otherwise, we're going to lose our stuff out here. And it's never coming back. Oh, we already lost it. We already lost it. Where's my cart? There's my cart. Okay. Okay, there we go. Cart. I should start naming this Mario Kart. <laughs> Name it Mario Kart. That's that's some good stuff right there. Alright, anyway. I remember the first indie horror game I played was Amnesia the Dark Descent. That game scared me so bad that I couldn't play for like a day. Thanks, Water Monster. Absolutely ridiculously terrifying. Don't know if it has the same effect now. That was a scary game. That was a scary monster. Like 10 out of 10 scary. What's going on? There we go. This way. This way. Follow the arrow through the fog. Over hill, over dale. Hit the dusty trail. With a mace. Yeah, the Amnesia series is one I've also enjoyed so much. Not so much Machine Machine for Pigs. I liked it for what it was. Oh my god. That dude, well, I'm not worried. That didn't hit as hard as I thought. I thought it hit way harder, but... Nope. Stupid things are following me. Take that, trees. That'll show them. That'll show them. I don't know why I almost hit R for reload. Reload my mace. Yeah, I was reloading the mace. I think the cart's got a couple more trips to it, and then I gotta like, <laughs> then I gotta like, you know, take it back here and hope it doesn't explode, or be smart and build like stuff in front of it, or build build a build a station. Man, Mace, Mace knocks people around, man. I'm, I'm pretty impressed. Pretty impressed. But yeah, on the other thing, I've got Resident Evil 2, like I said, all of next month. Also, Amnesia the Bunker, which I am truly excited about. 
that game. Seems like a sleeper hit, in my opinion. Was that it? Did I have more? Nope, that was it. Okay. Thought so. Well, let's go and ching that up a little bit. I'll bring a ching ching. Play stacks. There we go. Where are my deer jerk? I'm going to put all my jerky in here. Just add this. There we go. Nice. We did it. We're good. Play stacks. I've got pants. I've got pants. And a mug. That's all I need. Is pants and a mug. That's all you really need is pants and a mug. Alright. We did it. We did it. Here we are. Do I have any more bees? Yep, I probably could go out here and get some more honey bees. Oh, it's empty. Never mind. No more honey for me. That is fine. Worst part is I built some honeybees out next to the dilapidated barn, and it's so much worse there now. Let's go to sleep. There you go. They sleep, I drink coffee. What is this? There's a thingy right next to the... What's it? All right. Hello, world. It's time to... Go outside, day 55. Four days after the incident. I think it was five days after the Four days after the incident. I don't remember. I do remember the incident, though. I'm not going to talk about it. And if anybody asks, I'm going to pretend I forgot it. We'll say it was a uh, dilapidated barn was getting more into character. That's what I should say. Yes, dilapidated barn was getting way more into character. That's what I'm assuming happened. We'll be back at some point. Okay. After this cart gets reasonably filled up, I'm going to take it back all the way back here, and we're going to learn how to build a boat. That way we can sail around and not do it super slow, I think. Having not built a boat together for, well, in real life or any life, I couldn't tell you. But I hear boat is the way to go instead of slab with a piece of cloth on it boat's got way more aerodynamic capacity making for an overwhelmingly happier time here's some mushies and personally people just like boat better it's a very my summer cars jam yeah it's the one th it's the missing link it's the thing that it's the thing that connects my summer car and this game together is boat chan that's right, Boat Chan. Get out of here. I know you're happy to see me. I'm happy to see you too. Let's see. Is there more? Of course there's. Oh, you guys are the worst. Just here to up my levels. That's all they're here for. Hello, Tin. Nice, I'll smash you with my... Well, that was easy. Where's my cart? Is it right here? There it is. Hello, cart. Back. All right, how to... Oh, look at that. It was like that gap was made for the cart. I think it was. We're back over here, the, the place of our original adventure. So that was a good time over here. Did you hear of Lies of Bee? I have. I've actually been looking at that. I thought about buying that for PS4. Because it looks fantastic. It looks it looks like different Bloodborne. It looks like anime Bloodborne. But I hear the story is about Pinocchio. Which is also good. I like that story. Let's, let's get off the cart. Be an idiot and mine right next to this skeleton thing. It looks good. I like it. I, I, it's definitely on the list of stuff I want to play. Go, go, Gadget 10. I still haven't played... Oh, what was that other game? What the name of the game? I have it. It looks really good. 
There's the one where everybody was like, this looks like Dark Souls. It's okay. I remember it eventually. Song of Horror? It wasn't Song of Horror. It was the one where you turned into a rock. To, like, parry stuff. But I have that one. I have the full version of that. I played the demo. Mortal Shell. That's right. Mortal Shell. That's it. That's exactly it. Good job. Ooh, more stuff. I will get the stuff out of this rock. Because that's... Oh, it's all copper. Oh, this is a big boy copper. That'd be good. Yeah, I, I enjoyed the demo. And I did watch uh, Dead Dinosaur when he, was, when he used to stream play that. Oh. <laughs> We're trapped by a milky non-milk substance. Whatever could it be? Vote on your telephones now what this is. Is it A, milk, B, non-milk, C, Well, you know, we can't make that joke. Hey, Odin, how's it going? Long time, no see. Get out of here. It's C. Yeah, it's C. It's C. It's, C. it's all coconut milk. That's right. Almond milk and coconut milk. Not the other C that we were all probably not thinking of. Definitely not that one. Coconut milk. But it, it, it surrounded us while we were down here. A little scared. Oh, man. Look at that happy little card up there. I actually know what I... I, I actually use... Like almond milk. And soy milk a lot more than I use regular milk anymore. When you get to a certain age, your tummy starts making weird noises if you drink too much milk or eat too much ice cream, especially when you're not used to it. So you gotta find ways to not to delactose yourself. I saw right, so your construction helmet. Let's do it. The construction helmet. Let's go. I could have had that for a while. I just didn't put it on the list. Construction helmet. My construction helmet came out from a uh, from a old from an old uh, strip mine that I explored way back in the day. Highly recommend you go explore strip mines. They're fun. See if I can get these here. Come on, baby. There we go. All right. All right. All right. All right. This kind of production of wear because I got to change my earbuds. My will go to earbuds. Looks like they're sold. I need new ones. Oh, yeah, there we go. Ah, uh, Sarko. This is a real miner's act. Now we're in character. Also, the sound sounds totally different out of these than it does for my really high quality Sennheiser. Get out of here. I will smash you into. Well, there we go. Comes to you guys, if it's smash or pass, it's always smash, but not in the way they want. You had a stripper thought maybe part of an old stripper's uniform you had? Then old one? Are you saying that my old stripper uniforms are not as good as my new stripper uniforms? For shame. Have a nice stream. All right. Thanks for stopping by, Odin. Have a great nap. Hope to see you next time. Stream is not nearly as exciting as the last stream so far. My last stream was truly a really bad time. I think I'm nearly full up on stuff. I got to, like, put you place stacks. There we go. All right. Let's pick up all this stuff then. Just suck it up. Just suck it up as you do. 
I mean, come on. Have you have you heard of the Chippendales? Have you heard of the Chippendales? Well, I'll let you know. I'll have you know that A, I was never on the Chippendales, and B, I never tried out for it either. But if I had, oh man, they would have had to change the program. You know, you, you've seen the old, uh, the old uh, Saturday Night Live with Chris Farley and the Chippendales routine. It would have been something like that. Would have been in. Remove pants. Fine. I actually have to use the bathroom, so I'm going to use the bathroom and then I'll remove pants. So I'll be right back. Prepare yourselves an additional delicious snack or drink. I'm going to use the bathroom real quick. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I'm back. You guys ready for some anti-pants ASMR? I'm ready for some anti-pants right here ASMR. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Everybody happy now? I gotta plug that in there so I don't so the belt doesn't go directly up my butt. That has almost happened a couple times. Alright, there you go. And now we're playing in the danger zone. Or I should say how I used to play before I had a webcam. Now the dangerous part is, there's a smaller possibility, or a small possibility, <laughs> there's a small possibility that I end up like getting up and forgetting to turn on the, on the, on the you know, like the BRB screen. And everybody gets a show. And people will guess, is he wearing tidy whities is he wearing boxers? Nobody knows. This is a mystery. If I were smart, I'd make two oh. of these things. But yeah, not even lying. I used, I used to stream without pants. This is probably at least every other stream back before I got a webcam. I don't remember when I got a webcam. What stream did I do when I first with a webcam? Oh, I can't remember. Yep, I'm going to eat some mushrooms and turkey. There we go. All right. Dark Souls 2. Was it Dark? No, I played Dark Souls 2 without a webcam on the whole way. Can't remember. Something. Yeah, because I played like a couple games after that. Oh, wait. No, the answer is complete. The answer is clear. I remember it was Baldy. I started playing up. Oh, I don't want that. You get out of here. It was Baldy. I'm pretty sure Baldy was the first one. I played it without pan, without with it, without the webcam for a while. But there was definitely some Baldy action going on. Oh wait, wait, wait! I don't want that. Let's get in there. Get in there. You get in there too. You too. One piece of wood. Let's play stacks. Play stacks. Stacks. Yeah, it was after it was after DS2. I didn't I didn't I definitely did not Oh, I didn't want to do that either. These buttons suck. I gotta recombodulate everything in here, and that takes time that I don't feel like spending. All of you just get in here. I'm gonna put the, what is this thing? A neck trophy shirt. Sure, let's put that in there too. That's all trophies. Okay. 
run out here and smash this guy's butt. Get smashed. Grab my one honey. Make some more jerky. Oh, man. And prepare to fix everything. And then go back out. That was it? Yes. So good. Also so good. Right. Out we go. Back down. All right, we're just going straight. Yeah, basically straight that way. Yeah, straight this way. Good. Yeah, oh man. Now I'm starting to remember Dark Souls 2. That game had some... There's some weird stuff going on in Dark Souls 2. Also the first game I ever streamed, by the way, too. Pro tip. Maybe don't start with Dark Souls 2. Game is really hard. <laughs> I don't remember why I decided that would be a good game to stream first. It kind of was okay. It's over here. It's over here. Yeah, I wouldn't recommend streaming a Dark Souls game right off the bat. Especially one you haven't played. All right. I see you. Yeah, you're going for a rock at me. I'm going to come up and wail on you. For Ow! You too. You too. Get in line. Get in line. Yeah, playing a dark playing a Dark Souls game is all about just shredding your confidence. <laughs> shredding your confidence. And then it's a, it's it's like joining the military. It just destroys you and then builds you back up. That's what was going on. All right, I could eat another bite. I could. What do I need? Got deer jerky. Got some shrooms. I could eat a steak. Delicious steak. There's my cart next to all my stuff. Kerchunk. Kerchank, Kerfunk, Kedank. Don't worry, after we fill the cart up, we're going on it. We're building a boat. I don't know how to build a boat, but we're going to figure it out. And then we're going to sail around, not to the place where we die, unless they give us cannons. If they give us cannons, oh, who are we giving? If they give us cannons, we're still going to die. Oh, man, we're back at that white, not milk substance. We're waist deep in non milk substance. A little topical though, wearing a mining helmet. Wearing a hard hat while I'm mining. That's what you call being a character. Oh, we dig, 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 dig the whole night through. We dig, 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 dig. Ow. Oh, interrupted my song. We dig, 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 dig. We dig the whole night through. We dig, 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 dig until we have to poo. What are we mining? We don't know. What are we doing? We don't know. That's a Disney song right there. You guys watch the uh, any of the Disney live action movies? I've seen one. I saw Jungle Book, and it wasn't terrible. The Jungle Book was not terrible. The live-action Jungle Book. High, not recommended. I wouldn't say highly recommended. Just recommended. I also thought The Little Mermaid was pretty good, too. But I also heard that there's no, like, French chef in that version either, which is the entire reason why you should watch the movie. La Poisson, I love La Poisson. To cut and to serve little fish. I cut off their heads and I tool out the bones. You know how it goes. 
Yeah, that song's completely missing, evidently. I could eat another bite. Man, this is like working out is really making me need food or something. It is the best. La Poisson, La Poisson, how I love La Poisson. And we cut into several little fish. Je t'adore. What is this? What is this? How on earth could I miss such a sweet little succulent crab? How am I not employed by Disney? I'm not in the right position to use the cart. There we go. All right, good. Good, good, good. Place some stacks in there. What else I got in here? All right. Well, oh, that's a. That's mostly rocks. Mostly. You know what? I'm taking it back. Let's go. Not in the right position. There you go. All right. That did not work out as planned. All right. That sucked. Uh, uh, drop it. Okay. Oh, crap. Oh, good. Jeez. Can I push this? Can I push? Do I have to go back and... Oh, God, no. There you go. Oh, right. Oh, no. Well, that's some good news, bad news situation right there. I wonder if we just flip over I do this. Yeah, that's... Mm -hmm. Yeah. Can I... Oh, you... Cart! Every time! Please. I don't even know how to get this... Yeah! Oh my god, if I only had use of my hands! That completely negated the purpose of the cart! I can't use the cart. Can I get in the cart? No, I can't get in the cart. Oh. oh I'm a little upsetty spaghetti about that one. That was not grah. Ooh. Angry. I wonder if I just... I mean, it's going to save anyway, right? So if I save, log out, restart it, maybe my cart reflipperates re re itself? I don't think this is going to work. But I have smidgens of hope. Come on, baby. Flip the cart. Flip the cart. Flip the cart. Flip the cart. I know it wants to. It really wants to flip the cart. If it's a good game, it'll flip the cart. If it's a great game, it won't flip the cart. Flip the cart. Flip the cart. Flip the cart. Everybody say it with me. Flip the cart. Flip the cart. Come on. You can do it. It is not even remotely flipped. Damn it! Fine. Fine. I will go and dig my cart out. Go flip my cart out. Oh, I'm a little mad about that. I was like, let's go take the cart back. This will be fine. No, it wasn't great. It was stupid. Stupid flippy cart. It's like Flappy Bird, but it's a cart and it's flipping instead of flapping. All right. Thought we were going to do some stuff. Now it is a, just purely a mission to flip the cart back over. Can require digging. A buttload of digging. I'll take that flint, actually. You know what? That's good flint. It's a good for lucky flint. Whoa. That is not an ideal permission or uh, the thing. Not ideal. Ugh. And I'm sure there's an easier way to do this. But my first instinct is to dig a hole underneath it and knock it into the hole. Now 
I'm taking out my aggression on these things right here. Get aggressive. You, uh, explosions. I only have one? Okay. I get one charcoal out of that. That's fine. Okay. Let us fix our stuff. There we go. Let's go back. There we go. That works too. That works too. Do we got any bees? Got one honey. Good. Oh, I flipped my cart. That's it's already kind of, I, th I thought we had a plan. Thought there was a plan. There ain't no plan. Got some more jerked. Uh, is it jerk? Is it jerky or is it jerked honey? I think it's gonna be jerked honey. Jerked honey sounds actually kind of weird. I don't know if I'd be jerked honey. Jerk chicken is delicious. Jerk seasoning is it's, it's really good. The sixth grader in me kind of, you know, laughs at, you know, the word jerk. And I'll admit the 30 to 42 year old laughs too. It all works out in the end. Okay, this is... Okay, game. Just you and me. And a flipped cart. Let's go. You can do this game. We're in this together. Don't have to be... Don't have to be that kind of game. All you gotta do is just flip the cart back over. Grab it by the haunches and flip the cart back over. Did I even label where my cart was? I better have. I keep forgetting you like World of Tanks like zoom in this game. Oh, hey, whoa, there's where I like it. Whoa, how, how long can I do that without people getting sick? <laughs> I bet not very long. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna get this because just I just need it. We we took all the rest of it. Got it. Okay, it's time to play flippy cart. Um, how shall I flip this cart? I'm gonna flip it this way. Not gonna flip the cart. I've got a. You know what? I got a good feeling about this. Come on, you can do it. Not you guys. I'm trying to do some work here. You guys are basically just trying to ruin my day. There's a lot of you out here. That's a little disturbing. What? Are, oh god, it's a brute! Oh god, it's a brute! I'm just trying to flip the card. How come this guy comes out here every time I'm trying to do something important? Ow. Duh, damn it! The blocking did nothing! Oh, he's smashing my cart! What is life even more? Anymore? If my stuff disappears from that cart, I am going to go on a rampage this game has never seen before. Prepare for nakedness. Taking. You know what? Prepare for nakedness. I'm just gonna run out there and grab my shit. <laughs> All I wanted to do was get my car, but no, I'm not allowed to get my car. I have to go out of the way out here and get your stuff again. That looks like something. Perhaps. I hope it's just more resin. Oh, everything is pain. But it's okay. Because at least it's easy. That's a rock. I mean, I do like rocks. But that rock. 
There's the big boy. There's the big boy. I am going to sneak. Does he see me? Nope. Shall we use our sneakification skills. Which I am basically a master at stealth. To find our now probably broken cart. Oh, oh, I think he saw us. Did he see us? I can't tell. I can't tell if he sees us. He saw us. 100%. Nope, that guy saw us. Give me... There it is. I see us. There we are. Prepare. For the revenge arc. My cart gone. My cart is destroyed. Oh, God! I'm getting my stuff, and we're going to smash this guy's face in, because that's just how we do. And then we're going to come back stronger, smarter, more chest hair. Was Joe Crapper or is Joe Crapper? <laughs> you know, the inventor of the toilet. <laughs> it's inventor of the toilet. You know what? I can just eat one of those. There we go. Can't eat that. That's all cold. Jill Crapper is a strong, beautiful, womanly person. She knows how to get it done, and she's not afraid to do it. I swear I had freaking berries in here somewhere. Where's my berries? Not berries, it's red things. Also not berries. I thought I had berries in here. No, I had rubies. Rubies, berries, it's all the same. Oh, not you. How come everything's bigger now? You know, I'm taking a nap. I don't need this. I don't need this. We're just... Oh, okay. I can't. Because this thing's out here. All right. Where's the crap axe? Get me. This guy's going to die. There you go. Eat crap. Now we're going to sleep before that guy shows up. Oh, damn it. The game is just coming after me right now. All I want is my stuff back. I swear, I was going to leave. And the game heard me. And it was like, you ain't going nowhere. <laughs> Prepare thy butt for pain. That's what the game said. Prepare thy butt for pain. No, I'm going to go... I'm going to go back there during the daytime. Because you know the song. Don't blame it on the sunshine. Don't blame it on the moonlight. Don't blame it on the good times. Blame it. <laughs> on the boogers there we go blame it on the boogers which is my official name for these gnome people all right we're, we're getting our stuff back this time this is a no lose situation as in we cannot lose our card is destroyed but our piles of stuff is still sitting there This axe is getting ditched, too. Sure, it is serving a singular perp. My god, these things are everywhere. Might as well kill it. It's going to follow us. They all are going to follow us. Ow. Oh, everything sucks. Not going according to plan. Blocking with this does nothing. Oh, 
Oh, I'm worse. I'm not fighting anything. I'm just running over there. <laughs> God. We're building a club. That's what I'm doing. We're building a club. Angry. Angry. If I just pick up my stuff, I can kill everything. But no, it's all the way over. Somebody put a big dude over there. Let me build a freaking club. There's a club. It's just sticks. Cl club is just sticks. We got sticks. Right? I got one stick. Tell me I don't have any loose sticks over here. God, get sticks. Gotta pick up some sticks. There's a stick. Give me that stick. You guys are proto sticks. <laughs> it's all coming apart at the seams. Gotta take one of you, a couple of you, eat it. There we go. I got more health. Good, good. Pick up this stick here. Mine. It. That's six sticks. That's six sticks. Let's go get it. Prepare to be clubbed. Prepare to be clubbed. I'm gonna build a club. Boop, there we go. Got a club. Oh, my butt itched right there, so I scratched it. That's right. All right let's go. <laughs> okay. Now. After silly comedy deaths, it's time for the redemption arc because I have a club. This is Dark Souls deprived moment. See that combat roll? We did it. And we ain't stopping for anything. You? I don't even know what you're trying to do here. You're going to have a bad time because I'm a master at clubbing. Oh, God. I gotta kill everything comes after me. Because reasons. If I don't, they just follow me for literally miles. Okay. This is going to be... Where am I? I am like... It's right there. It's right there. Okay. This is not... The greatest. Oh, that big dude hadn't shown up and crapped in our spaghettios. We would have been fine. Oh God! You know what? Screw it. I'm not fighting you. Can't make me. I am on a mission to get my crap back, and they can't stop us because Well, I'm, I'm on a mission. All I gotta do is run up there and touch it. And then everybody... Everybody pays. Over here. Big dude's over here. That's fine. I have a club. Soon, I will have a slightly spikier club made out of metal. And then, once I get all my crap over here, I will have a ton of stuff. There it is. Give me. This is mine. All mine. My car has exploded. You know what? You know what? Bring it. Let's go. Let's go. Is this how you want to die? The slightly better club? There you go. Prepare. Drop that over there. You need one of these. You need some bloobs. Where's my pants? Putting them on. That's how we do it. That's how we do it. What else do I need? Nothing? Good. That's all I wanted. Throw this wood out. There's rocks. Don't need this. Don't want this. Don't want the puke berries. And now... Now, I'm going to go back and start picking up my stuff. Even though... Oh, can I, how much do you guys pick up? I'm carrying too much. Damn it. Drop it. 
Not too much. Oh, I have to drop so much weight. Get out of our berries. Uh, what can I drop? This? This? My nails? Almost need to make another cart. I have to drop everything except for the... Uh, what am I dropping? Drop this. Drop this. Drop this. Not even close. It's not even close. I have to like section out. I have to coordinate or section out this. It was too much. Okay, we'll take the nails back. Split the stack. 240. Okay, split the stack again. 320. Split the stack. 280. That is close enough. Oh, stupid cart. I'm making a new cart and we're going to come out here and we're going to pick all this stuff up and we're going to leave. That's how it's going to work. Now I have a mace. Oh, that big guy, he's going to just... Yeah, they're still there. I just can't build it unless I build another thing. Which I should have built out there, but I'm dumb, so I'm going to run all the way back. Like a dingus. But I got my stupid thing back. Well, stupid now. <laughs> Don't want any of your food. You're just in my way. Something throwing rock. Of course there's something throwing rocks at me. new cart and we're bringing everything back because otherwise what's the point what is the point point? and then we're going to build a boat and we're going to go on a jolly adventures across the ocean they are easy I, I am an idiot and i shouldn't be taking this cart all the other but if i don't something's going to munch on my butt and not in the way that everybody wants to munch on your butt the bad way Let's go. Time to build a cart. I should have everything I need, or at least close to everything I need. Yep, we got 20 wood. Got that. All right. Okay. New cart, new day. Cart life is easy. There we go. All right. We got ourselves a new cart. It's time to go over here and load up the new cart. Okay. Squeaky, squeaky. Ah. Everybody likes new cart smell. You go to the you go to the dealer, you pick up a new cart. It gets caught on something. It's fine. Okay, we smashed this tree. This tree too. Pick up the cart. I don't know how many damage I did to that cart. It's probably fine. I'm assuming it's fine. You just stop it. We don't have time for this dilly-dallying. We've got carts to pick up. Or crap to pick up onto the cart. There we go. Happiness is a new cart smell. One object who would have thought? Look, it's 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 all about the means of production. I don't know what that has to do with chopping down a uh, a tree with a blunt object, but uh, mark my words, I'm going to take advantage of that particular phrase because it sounds important. You know, that's that's really all you got to do. As long as it sounds important, you're pretty much good to go. It worked. Yeah, exactly. Nobody questioned it. They were just like, "Yep, means of production." I was like, yeah, means of production. All right, now we've... Oh, oh, I can't look backwards. That's right, without going backwards. Just gonna drink some coffee. I'm referring to everything means of production from now on. It's an easy way to uh, add legitimacy to whatever you're doing. Hey, giant thumb, why, why do you... Why do you... 
buy so much cereal? Well, you know, means of production. Oh, wow, ah, okay. That makes sense. Why are we wearing the white helmet? Well, you know, means of production. That's what I'm doing. White helmet is just means of production. Oh, I don't know if I can get through there. Nah, I'm wearing white helmet. Yes, it's it's actual. Actually, this. Oh, get away! Stop it! You too. Why do you gotta be dicks? Are the bosses exactly? That's exactly right. I'm always doing stuff like a box. I float this thing. I better be able to float this thing. If this thing doesn't go across the water, I'm going to be slightly perturbed. Good, good, it worked. Actually, this could be a boss's hell or a hard hat. I don't know. I got this from an old strip mine. My friends and I were. It's a Sarkel. It's a strip. It's a coal mining company. Could eat another bite. You're trying. You right, you right. When you right, you right. Let's eat some beef. Beef. Yeah, I found this in a strip in a uh, in a drag line, which if you haven't seen one of those, you got to look those up. Those are crazy, huge earth moving moving machines, like crazy huge. They are massive, and they're fun to explore. There was a bunch of abandoned ones where I used to live, and a bucket wheel excavator, which are ridiculously cool. Don't do it, ah. Okay. You know what? I was yeah, I should be working on cart Mark II. The Mark II cart would be better than this. There we go. All right, everything's right here. What you got to do is just move this into a position where it's not going to fall down into the trench. Are you gonna fall down the trench? You want to? It's really close to falling down the trench. I'm gonna take off. Let's get it. Bring too much weight. Oh no. Oh no. Drop the rock. Drop the rock. Drop the rock. We're good now. Of course we're not. Like this. Oh, I drop all of it. It's fine. There we go. I'm carving you know what? I'm carving it out. One was a uh, Making it walk across a main road that didn't move too fast, but man, they dig a lot of dirt. Oh yeah, yeah, those things are super slow. They're awesome though. Ooh, there's copper over here. I didn't know there's copper over here. I'm just gonna keep mining it then. Might as well keep mining this. Oh yeah, the bu the bucket you could you could park a small like small drag lines you can park like a small like an S10 in. I would be, always thought it'd be cool to have one of those instead of a garage, just a scoop where you drive your S10 into. That'd be sick. We got it. I'm gonna move this rock in here. And this wood. This up. Don't too much weight. It's true. That's why we built this ramp to play stacks. Holy crap! It's Velvet Knight. How are you doing? You missed it. We died stupidly. You piece of shit. You are not gonna. I'm missing. I'm overweight and I'm missing. There we go. Jesus Christ. This is all just comedy. Oh, I can't go over there. We're dead. Uh, not in the right position. What position do I? Oh, my God. Dump it. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But right back in the hole. This is fine, too. Oh. Yeah, Parker. Yeah, four full size. Oh, yeah. The big ones. The big ones are awesome. Okay. Fine. We're doing Move you back here. There we go. Are you happy now? Just trying to move some stuff. 
this is this is this is basically how it went. So so well, this is basically how the uh, the day's been going. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna be efficient. I am going to go and get a cart, and I'm gonna move it over here and go on some adventures. I'm not in the right position. And I'm gonna go and just fill the cart up so we got like an efficient way to move all our stuff. And you know what? Everything exploded. Everything exploded. This cart is really picky. My sex. There we go. That's all we had to do. I'm gonna make a strawberry. There we go. So we were like, okay, it's time to go back because our cart's like at hell, half health. And then somebody went and attacked our cart. And it all exploded and went terribly wrong from there. Terribly, terribly wrong. Is there any more stuff to mine out here? I don't know. I would like some. Got some copper. Yeah, I might as well since we're here. Bang. And we're copper. That's a copper. Chunk. Good chunk. Good chunk. Ooh, that's a big copper. The cart, not the storage here? Oh, I was? Oh, okay. All right. But anyway, so how are you doing today? We are going to build a boat and go on adventures. I don't know if I have time to go on adventures today, but we are definitely going to get in the preliminary preliminary uh, boat building phase. Wait, stacks. There we go. All right. Okay. About copper veins? What is the secret about copper veins? There's more, oh wait, there's more copper. I see more copper over there. I'm gonna... But you got my work day. One more meeting in an hour and you're free. Freedom, horrible freedom. That's good, that's good. <laughs> Hopefully the meeting goes fast. We get it? We got it. Look at all that copper. We're normally more below the ground, we can't see. Ah, okay, I kind of thought that. But again, you know. Stupid. Uneducated, that's what it is. Not so much stupid. There we go, alright. Alright, cart. Just you and me. And this tree that is definitely in the way. Oh, come on, you can do a cart. I have faith. I don't know if this is more efficient or less efficient. Obviously, my thong is showing, too. I, I'm not comfortable about that. I was really trying for a not jank scream until I got the cart. And the cart just added, like, this level of jank that I was ill-prepared for. Okay. The bush is too tough for the... There you go. Got it. Shouldn't be wearing it. I mean, look, look, look. You're also right about that. I will admit. But, you know, it's got to be on my own terms, you know? It's got to be on my own terms. I'm not sure if I'm quite up at, like, Fortnite levels of donk, but it's pretty close. It's pretty close. Say what people will about my hairdo. God, that is, this is just, I don't like sprint, I'm trying, well, see, I can't really sprint because I'm in the black forest right now, and now this cart's getting stuck on everything, there we go, sprint, eh. Also, I'm adding to the drama, adding to the drama. There we go, that's some sprint there. Why not wearing any clothes? Well, tragically, and I think you were here for the, oh God, you guys. Tragically, all my clothing got left over next to the giant tree. Stop it! I will murder you. And I was like, why build temporary stuff when I can just get a bunch of copper and mine my way to a new set of metal pants? Which I am going to do. Because I have the will and the way. Oh, this is not great. None of this is great. Sounds like a plan. Yep. And it was all going fine until I... Oh, cart! Until the cart happened. 
Now the card is jammed on the thing. Now I have to cut down a tree. This is fine. Everything is fine. That better not land on my cart. If this lands on my cart, anger. Good. Didn't land on the cart. And the cart is free. Good. We did it. Mission accomplished. With nothing happening, that could possibly cause the cart to get worse. All right. There you go. A ton of nails. Okay. ton of nails. I do have a lot of nails. Oh, you mean they're all into nails. Yeah, that's a good idea. I was actually thinking about doing that. But how many nails is like too much? Get, okay, there goes sprinting kind of look. Oh my God, the fog. We've entered Silent Hill. Oh, we're stuck on a rock kinda. I mean, if if we made a ton of nails, we could we could make oh we could so so you know what a, you know what a ground aerator is? It's basically a, a rolling a rolling uh, a steamroller with a bunch of spikes in it that aerates the ground. We could make one of those. We have the technology. A Viking. Aerator. I heard that. They're, they're in the trees over there. I see them. Or, or, we could make a ton of nails. You need spikes. They do. Everything kind of needs spikes. Hey, pig. Or, hear me out. Athletic cleats for the Viking soccer team. Holy crap, we actually made it back. Sick nasty. Oh, that's... We did it. Holy crap. I didn't think we'd ever actually get back. This thing wants to die. Obviously wants to die. Make a throne out of nails welded together. Oh my god. Ah! Oh, ah! Don't do that! Who threw that? You piece of... Not in well for you. There we go. All right. That is perfect. You know what? I'm going to go one better. I'm just going to drag this thing over to my smelter. Because he who smelt it can make more nails out of it. I still think we should go with like, with like cleats, like cleats for shoes. I think that practically is a business inside a business. Are better than swords, it's true. Why make one sword when you could make a bunch of tiny swords, AKA nails? Got one, honey. It's a good one. Gonna make some more of this. There we go. And drink some more coffee, which is really cold. But I got more jerky. Delicious. I feel this stream has not. Well, no, it went on an adventure. Who am I kidding? It went on a good adventure. To get resources. And we did it in a way that was. I make a rag tunic. You know what? That's good. Rag tunic. There we go. Everybody's happy now. I got a rag tunic. Ever played Project Zomboy? No, but everybody recommend, re recommends one of those. Or recommends that game. Oops. Let's repair everything. All right, there we go. I need... Wood. So the deforestation program can continue. All right, time to chop down some more trees with my fist. October, that'd be amazing to watch. Alright, I'll go and check it out. I do have other games to play in October. I have Resident Evil Resident Evil 2 and I have Amnesia the Bunker. Both games I'm really excited about. Ah! Jesus! Wasn't excited about that. That was not great. Not the best. Not the best, uh, 
prettiest face I've ever taken. If that's the other oh, Jesus, get up! Mm. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. You know what? That was, that was, we probably deserve that some reason. Somehow. Probably. That's what I get for making pants and a shirt. Okay. Okay. Well, let's go get our stuff back and continue chopping down this tree. Uh, next time we will not go and stand downhill. Where's my stuff? There it is. All right. Thank you for causing the comedy death of the game. Good. Okay. Put our stuff on. Pants. Tunic. I feel like we were. I was a very accomplished. Odin is impressed. I'd be impressed. Look. Takes a real man to take a freaking log to the face and get resurrected. Ow! Stop it! Jesus. Stupid thing. Get. Destroy it. Stop rolling around. Well, actually, you know what? You can roll around as much as you want, log. The more you roll around, the more dabbled you do to things. And then I can go around and vacuum up all this wood. I'm really tired of these guys. Where are you? Oh, you're right there. I hope I defeat the tree demon that that... Oh, I'm overburdened. I'm overburdened. What did I pick up? It's all this rock. And... <laughs> Damn it. There you go. Everybody remember where I parked. Everybody remember where I parked. Eat some jerky and this and a little bit of mushroom. Oh, you can definitely go for it. <laughs> I'm okay with that. Log to the face. Oh, yeah. Good stuff. All right. This time I'm going to die. I do miss my sharpened club. My sharpened club was pretty OP. Cool. How much coal do I have? Okay, we're running out of coal fast. Don't process this as bull items because I picked them up over here. That's fine. <laughs> you know, at least it wasn't falling. There was a point where most of my streams were nothing but me falling. Where all my clips were falling. Usually off of bridges. We got that. That's great stuff right there. I'm going to add that back in. Boink. There we go. All right. Good. 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 All right. We got some of that. Let's go back inside. Get our coal. Yoink. Got some coal. All right. Good. It's... It was a side effect of something falling. That's that's pretty much what it was. Side effect. Got it. All right. We have what, he, what people would call some sort of means of production. It's a little honest and fall, isn't it? Oh, it's zero? Oh, because I'm macing it. Because I'm stupid. There we go. I was wondering, why am I chopping so fast and nothing, nothing's happening? Well. <laughs> I don't want to say we did it. But we did it. Okay, there we go. Got plenty of wood. So many resources. And look at these bees. They're so well paid. These bees are crazy well paid. Oops. I'm going to take more copper. You'd think there would be a smarter way and better way to do this, but I'm obviously doing it the dumb way. Oh, I had wooden here. I didn't actually need to do that. That's fine. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. 
Small trees, not so much of the bigger trees. Since it was you did it on purpose for science, right? Exactly. You you know you have figured me out to a T. Um, the thing is that the mace actually wasn't sure, and I figured if I just swung hard enough, because I mean, what is a mace but a round axe? It is definitely a round axe. Now, I figured if it's an axe of any sort, it should be completely able to uh, handle anything I'm throwing at it like that. So, that's, uh, you know, that was what I was doing. So, it's sound logic. Yeah, that's right. Time to pick up my rewards. Copper, 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 and copper. And weirdly, I'm not overweight, but I'm going to add this to my copper supply. Over here. Play stacks. I actually am going to get rid of the puke berries and add more copper. And probably move that out there too, because, you know, I don't need that either. In fact, we'll just put this in here. There we go. We did it. Perfect. Game is brutal. It is brutal. Um, I mean, as you as you know, eventually we have to travel back over here and uh, reclaim our stuff. Where is it? There it is, right there. That's our stuff, right there. Reclaimed our sharpened club and whatever else we had on us. I think it's just a sharpened club, some jerky, our pictures of our pet cat, something like that. I don't remember what we have in there. Eventually. Smelter. Where's the smelter demon when you need it? Hey, yo, smelter demon. All right, I think we actually have enough. We're starting to get enough where we can make enough bronze to make some bronze stuff. I mean, granted, we haven't gone on any grand adventures. Well, we had a cart. That The cart was the grand adventure of the day. <laughs> That's what it was. The cart was the grand adventure of the day. All right, make bronze time five. Oop. A big truder to slowly walk across the bottom of the ocean, make it. Oh God! Don't even say it. I feel that, in all honesty, that's going to happen, and I'm really not excited about that. Okay, ran out of that. Okay, we got ourselves a crap load of bronze. Well, mediocre amount of bronze. That was not as much bronze as I was hoping I would get out of this trip, but that's okay. I, I dare say our our adventure sounds a lot more exciting or less exciting than it actually was. I can't sleep with this one. Of course I can't. Nope. Don't have any placeable objects. Get some stuff out of here. I'm going to get some tin. Let's start, let's start processing the tin. There we go. Got it. Rolling away from me. Okay. Alright, put the tin back. Boop. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, that's that's exactly what somebody would say that was totally expecting a giant to show up. If that giant chased me all the way here, A, this would be the best game of all time. And B, well, <laughs> we'd die. If you disturbed a god and it just chased you forever. That would be really funny. I think that's I think that should be an update. Just saying. He chases a long time. He destroyed he made the dilapidated barn 85% more dilapidated. A mod at least, yeah. Infinite infinite enemies. You thought you could escape, did you? Well, prepare to eat all of the shit. Pants, stuff, 
What can I build for 12 bronze? Let me pull some bronze out of here. What do we got? What do we got? I mean, I need leather. Bronze makes pick up buckler cultivator. Bronze plate needs five and two deer hide. Okay, five and two deer hide. Cabo hat. How's the Danny birds? How's it going? Okay. Ca oh wait, I don't have a cowboy hat. <laughs> I don't have a cowboy hat. Here. Let me show you. Here's my list. I can do it. There we go. All right. Here we go. The options. You can type in exclamation point hat list and you can see what hats I have. Well, what did I do that for? Okay, let's find our deer hide. Where did I put that? Do I have any deer hide? If I don't have deer hide. I just thought I had deer hide. Maybe I don't. I guess I don't. All right. Well, time to go hunt some deer. Caring too much. What shall I drop? Maybe this coal. Is that good? Nope. That coal was not heavy enough. Maybe I shall drop all of this. There we go. Tin foil hat. All right, let's do tin foil. <laughs> tin foil hat it is. Oh, good gourd. Yeah, I'm glad you didn't see that. I spun the mouse around and everybody would have puked. Everybody would have puked. Wouldn't be good. All right, Tim Boyle, where did, where did I put the Tim Boyle? Is it over here? I think it's on the TV. The Tim Boyle hat is good for like one thing. See, see, it's all up in the sky now. <laughs> it's good for one thing, and that's to stop the 5G from hitting, from from consuming us all. Also makes. Uh, there we go. All right. This tinfoil hat has survived a long time, by the way. I'm gonna put this right back there so everybody can look at it and be like, "Wow, what a nice hard hat that is." <laughs> All right. Ah, the ground again. Hey, ground. What's going on? You you got it. It's mostly so that you don't hear voices in your head and the 5G. That's the two big ones. What, what was that doing? I honestly forgot what I picked up. What did I pick up? Did I pick up a bunch of stuff and immediately dropped it so I could... I think I did. Maybe. Picked up that. That's good. <laughs> Too much. You've never seen this game? This game is amazing. It's Valheim. I deposited all of my chests. There we go. All right. It's basically a Viking survival game. It's really difficult. Or actually, it's, it's it's kind of easy, and then it gets really difficult. Oh, coal. I need more coal. Oh, I need to make more coal. Where'd my wood go? All oh, my wood's over here. Last time we fought a giant tree. And by fought, we mean uh, we got utterly destroyed. Like, not a fair fight. Even a little bit. There's absolutely zero fairness going on in the fight. And we lost all our stuff. And today, it was adventures with a cart. We made a cart. And the cart was very cool. I liked the cart. The cart was nice. Everybody liked the cart. <laughs> and then the cart betrayed us. And then we got attacked. Because, you know, that's what happens with the cart. Oh, too heavy. It's full. All right. See this cart? This is cart mark two. First cart betrayed us in horrible ways. Ways we shan't not speak of. That'd be hard, dude. Just makes it difficult. I'm not making it. I'm making it 
I'm probably making it difficult for myself. I won't. I won't. Won't say one way or the other how difficult I may or may not be making this. In my brain, this is the best way to do it. I don't know any different. <laughs> no different. But this time, we're going to suit ourselves up, build a boat, and go on different adventures. Tell me I had four bronze. Four bronze. That's fine. What do I have that's weighing me down? Oh yeah, wood. Carrying a lot of wood on me. There you go. I think we're going to get there eventually. Got ten. What do I got in the back here? What do I got in the back? What junk in the trunk doth I have? Not even overloading myself anymore. Oh yeah, look at that. Not even overloading myself. Oh, don't want that. What order did I put up? Okay, that's right. We'll, you know, we'll just keep that on us. It was just obliterated. It wasn't even, like, like there's fights where you can pretend you have a chance. And then there was going on with a giant tree boss. The elder, so to speak. And then it got worse because there's like another thing over there that can one shot us. Exceptionally easy. And it one-shot at us, and now our stuff's over there. But it's fine. We'll get over it. A lot of bronze. I think we've got enough bronze. We can do something. I need the... I've, I've got the wrong hide. To actually do anything. Alright, let's eat some more jerky. I can't eat more... Oh, that's right, I've got it. Let's eat this berry, then. There we go. That berry is delicious and nutritious. Part of this balanced breakfast or something, I don't know. But anyway, this game is this game is insanely fun. I highly recommend it. Oops, no, I still got ten in there. I still got ten. Put some of this in there. Take some of this out. That works too. All right, all right, all right, all right. Add some coal to the smelter here. Oh, yes. Oh, I'm out. I'm out. How dare me. How dare me. That too. That's perfect right there. Just perfect. Got more tin. I'm in, the, I'm in the narration part of the game where I'm just like, and now I'm picking up tin. And now I'm picking up ore. And now I'm chopping a tree. And everybody just sits there going, wow. How does he not have a million subs talking about exactly what he's doing? Just narrating what he's doing. That's that's some good stuff right there. Play snacks. There we go. All right, good. All right, put this right here. More coal. More wood. For the furnace. I could be making so much pizza in this oven right now. Unfortunately, for us, Viking pizza wasn't invented until six years after this game. And even then it was more like a cow's own. I don't even know if I could call it a pizza. Like, I'm, I'm probably some sort of pizza. Well, no, they are they are known for their pizzas. Like, before Little Caesars happened, there was Little Vikings. Like, Little Caesars was like historically slightly after Little Vikings, which is why there's Little Caesars today and Little Vikings kind of went away. But it's okay, it's okay. I'm not mad at them. 
competition and whatnot. Oh, I don't have enough of that anyway. Throw that here. All right, all right, all right, all right. More tin. The bees are happy. I like happy bees. Problem with Little Vikings Pizza was like a lot of the stuff that went on their pizza was just like pillaged from other pizza places. Which I mean, as a customer, doesn't bother me too much. But I mean, when you got like when you when you when you like your second favorite pizza place, like other than Little Vikings, it's like one day you just drive by and it's burned to the ground. Well, that that's it's kind of a problem. Small problem. Like roots to get top exactly, Velvet Knight. Exactly. It's like hey, you know how it was. You knew how it was. You're probably there. You've seen it. You're like driving down the road and you're like, jeez, Little Viking Pizza has raided the Pizza Hut across the lake. And I mean, that was part of the charm, too. That was the best part. Part of the charm. I have so much tin now. <laughs> this is the rest of the stream, by the way. Just me running back and forth and making this stuff. There we go. Look at that. Woo! We did it. And there was a lot of fish on pizza, too. Like, a lot of fish. Oh, good. We're back into copper. For the... Oh, yeah, that's right. Viking versus FNAF. The main difference was the... Uh, was, like, was like instead of, like, Freddy Fazbear, it was, like, an antelope. And then more antelopes. In fact, everything was just antelopes. There we go. And the Pizza Plex was a boat. I mean, there was boats in the, like, the original Pizza Plex. Got this. I got this. Look at this. Have you seen the amount of smelting we're doing? He who smelt it, dealt it. Oh, we're dealing in smelts right now. We're dealing in epic amounts of smelts. I'm caring too much. All right. Good luck, Velvet Knight. I'm, I don't know. I'll be, I'll be on for like another like, uh, like half an hour-ish. I work weird hours in the morning, so I got to like stuff to do before I got to like go to bed. I go to bed at like nine o'clock. I hate it. I have to get up at four to get to work at like 530. But if you make it, if we see you after that. We'll see. If not, I may be streaming tomorrow. I'm not sure yet. I don't have any more wood. Where's all my wood? There's some wood. Hey, we're wood. Got sick in school and decided to get better than share. Uh, I mean, that's tradition. Yeah, yeah. Hope, yeah, I hope she has a really short, you know. Hopefully everybody just has, like, a really short sickness when they get sick. I got one wood. One wood. I feel the need to chop more wood. And I know just what tree to take it out on. This one. Ugh. See? It practically chopped itself. What does she have? Does she have basically just a cold? Or does she have, like, you know, the flu or something like that? Or some unnamed retrovirus with which she is patient zero? Thus you are patient zero? Because that would be cooler, but worse. Not right back. No energy more. If I'm a bit saucy. Gotta oh, sweep, sweep, sweep. Good God. That is so loud. Thanks, Hero. Love it. I want to assume that Carpenter's and his daughter are patient zero. Because that's just, it's better head cannon. How's my hero? How's it going? <laughs> Ready for... Coal. More coal. Do it. That's a lot of coal. All right. Thank you for the lurk, Dana Burns. Hope to see you around more often. I may be streaming tomorrow. I'm not sure. We'll have to see. We'll have to see where I am tomorrow. Wouldn't that be something? I have a message for your so-called undertaker. My 
Hippo! Oh my god! Thank you for the subs! You're amazing! I appreciate that, man. I appreciate that. Thank you. It's all going into what is it? Oh yeah, by buying flaming hot Mountain Dew. Yeah, there we go. That's what your sub's gonna buy. If we could do another five or six of our thumbs, we would be living in the future. If all ten of our fingers were thumbs, we could conquer the past. The Soviet guy from Cancock or Red Alert or something. Ha! Space! You regret subbing? Everybody regrets subbing. I regret having you sub. You guys don't even know what I'm going to buy with us. They think it's going to be video games or perpetual or peripherals? No. It's going to be flaming out Mountain Dew. It's going to be awful. Uh, schedule all over. But yeah, it's it should be better now. As far as I can tell, I am back on morning shift indefinitely right now. They hired a bunch of new, a couple new people, so hopefully, fingers crossed, we should be good to go, at least for a while. How much are you streaming? I'm streaming for like another half an hour, give or take. I'm going to go and play stacks. Like a whole week. I didn't miss much. I mean, we've always had this mace. We definitely didn't leave it over here somewhere. Where there's something really, really bad. Actually, two things that are really, really bad over here. Really bad. They're going to use it for drugs because at least they're being on. I would never use it for drugs. Janky video games? Yes, maybe. Good chance. Spicy Mountain Dew addiction? Yes, probably. Is drugs? It's gonna. House isn't terrible. Did you steal it? This house isn't terrible? You guys made fun of this house mercilessly when I built it. This is. This is. Don't even understand you guys anymore. There are drugs. Look. There's. Look, look. Set it. There's two things. That, that I am horribly addicted to as a man. Shiny things and janky games. Boy, do I have janky games sitting around here that I'm just, I don't know if I want to subject you guys to. It's, it's they're pretty bad. They look bad. There is some sizable jank over here. Called Jesus Christ RPG, don't even know why. That is an amazing sounding game. I have to look that up. You know what you need to do? Senna, you need to go on Steam and find a game called Perilous Warp. Go on there and try, I mean, it's it's janky. It's not ridiculously bad, but it's, it is a, it is a sub-sanction of, of freaking slob jank that I don't think you've ever played before. It's like, so you know Doom 3, right? This is like that meme, we have Doom 3 at home. That's kind of what it is. Peril, perilous Warp. It is. I played it on Steam, on stream, and I never beat it because it's just it's just so jank at the end. That game, it's got it's slob jank. That's what it is. The greatest type of jank there ever was. Yep, look for it. It is not worth the price. But once you play it, you can say, "Hey, I played." Perilous Warp. Trailer Park Jank? Pair of Trailer Park Jank. That's what we should build here is a trailer park. We're building a trailer park in one of this in this game at some point. Oh, I am nearly out of knock. Let me eat one of these. Ah! Stop it! I'm trying to eat here, man! Ninja Bread Man level bad. It's it's not a bad game. It is just janky. There are bad parts of the game. Or, what was the other one I played? What was the one I played with the giant chickens? The Russian one with the giant... Oh, you are just ruining my day. Oh, I'm beating this with a freaking... Oh, I'm so dumb. It's okay. How did I chop down a tree using this? I'll think of it here. 
I'll think of it. Another guy, girl. There. No, I haven't actually seen any of the like the one girl at work recently. I think she's on vacation, maybe, or or her schedule's just wrong. Probably schedules are just wrong. Not really a whole lot of gossip at work. There's an Indian wedding going on tonight. I'm glad I'm not there. Risky? Yeah, I, I, I did it briefly. It was okay. My house looks like it's on fire. Not gonna lie. Beach girl. Went out with her for a couple of, well, not technically we weren't in a couple, but, you know, went out with her and hung out for a couple of months. It was all good. Doesn't work out at all. All right, all right, all right, all right. I'm going to go back in here and deposit this in here. But it's it's dating co-workers from different departments. Play stacks. Stacks and snacks. Get the fire thing you did. Exactly. Look, look. Senna knows what's up. You know what's up. I wouldn't do it. don't have any coal. I don't have any coal. I need... Ah. Uh, I'm gonna go back with this. There we go. I think darkness was hiding how shitty the house was. Oh, it's a great. It's, look, you got. I, you heard it. He said it was a nice house. Look at this. This house could take off and fly. It's so nice. See, looks fine. Looks fine. Add stacks. There we go. Yeah, there's Parasol. I'm still trying to remember what that game was I played. I gotta look it up. I gotta look it up. Give me a second here. We're looking it up. I got time. I got time to look this up. Everybody needs to experience this. This game. I can't remember what it was. But I need to figure out it. Need to figure it out. Do, 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 do. I will figure this out. This is, this game was just amazing. It had giant chickens. All the textures broke on me. Okay, that guy's over there. He's fine. It was. It was. Wait for it. We're going to find it. Maybe. Maybe. Not Singularity. Singularity was not jank. I'm going to find it. It's in here somewhere. It's in here somewhere. Everybody remembers Perilous Warp. No? Okay, fine. Oh, gotta do it the old-fashioned way. Do a search for it. This is... This game was amazing. Is You Are Empty. There you go. You Are Empty. That's the name of the game. Okay, You Are Empty. If you want... If you want just... Incredible jank. You are empty. There are giant chickens you fight in that game. It's it's just, it was artwork. It was art. It was some sort of something. I can't even call it art, really. Make more coal. Make more coal. Make more coal. Do more stuff. All this stuff. Do more coal. Make more coal. More coal. More wood. Boring stream. Danny Burns is back. Hey, how was whatever you were doing up? Or doing good? Doing up, doing good, doing something. More, more. That's right. What is the jankiest game you got? What What was a game you've ever played that was jank? Mine was like... 
I don't know what the jankiest game I played was. My Summer Car is probably the most consistently, purposely jank game. That game is... That game is all jank. But it's an endearing jank. It's a good jank. Greatest game... No, 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 that's... No, I, I refuse. Baldi's Basics and Education is janky. It is not good jank. No, Baldi is my least favorite jank. I despise it. Baldi should be, like, illegal in most states. It's so bad. Cool, all right. Oh, man, I got metal, too. Look at that copper. Don't soon be able to go and rule the world with the amount of copper I have. This is what's going to happen. I'm going to make all this stuff. Oh, I double stacked my copper. All right, it's time to go to tin, then. Love tin. Give me some tin. Yeah, tin. My cart seems to be getting slowly farther and farther away from all this stuff. That's okay. That's okay. All right. Have any bees? I did. Yay! All right. More jerky. I can make more jerky. I'm going to eat a jerky. Eat one jerky. Make two jerky. All right. Let's see. Mushy mush. I'll make a mushy mushroom. I have... Yes, exactly. I have... I have Spend too much time in Baldi. It's no, not good. It's not good. Spend more time, more time playing Baldi than any single person should. I can warn you all, don't play Baldi. That's why I'm not recommending Baldi, because it's a bad game. It's a really bad game. Nobody should play. Sanity, don't play Baldi. No matter what Hero says, don't do it. Yeah, Summer 85. Too much time in Baldi. But, uh, don't play Baldi. It's a bad game. Baldi's basic education and learning. I have a copy of a PS4 sitting right over there. Don't play it. So somebody could win. Oh, broke. Of course it broke. Should do a giveaway where you can win my copy, my last remaining copy of Baldi's Basics of Education and Learning. But you too can play it on PS4. Gotta repair my axe. I'm doing too much wood. Doing too much wood. Giant thumb story. All right. Let's repair some thumb. All right. All right. Anyway, Hero, how are the ladies? Are they got... Do they got all their joints and stuff all fixed up now? Or is it still a catastrophe? My tiny goblins whilst I was away. A little bit. I really didn't have, like, a super adventure today. I was mostly trying to get a bunch of, like, 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 tin and bronze so I could make, you know, armor and stuff. And then I decided I was going to take this cart out. And I took it out. And then the cart flipped over for some reason. And then I was trying to, like, fix it. And then I got attacked and I died. And then we spent, like, a little time going back and forth trying to get the stuff. And then it all worked out because we built another cart. And now we're on the second cart. And this cart is fine. Much better. And this whole last part has been kind of boring, me just running around doing this. Not sure why everybody's watching, but that's okay. It's all good. Play some stacks. Gotta make some bronze here real quick at some point. Both of them getting better. Excellent, excellent. That's good to hear. Feeding the machine. Just feeding the machine. Start building ourselves some stuff here. I got enough. Yeah, we could probably do this. Let me grab some of this stuff here. Start making more bronze. Craft it. Nice. 
It's a lot of bronze. Could just make it all all bronze nails. All bronze nails. That's what we really that's what everybody really wants. Just to make a crap load of bronze nails. So many bronze nails. Tin. Throw. Oh wait, tin tin is oh okay. Good, good, good. Chunk chunk. Alright. Not swords yet. We had a sword. Our sword is currently off um, exploring by itself over here, next to all these pirates. Our sword is right there, having an adventure all by itself. Now we have a mace. As you can see, it's a good mace. It's not over there, which makes it way, way, way better than the uh, sharpened club that we had. Way better. Sharpen club, not as good as slightly spark or spiky club. Everything is better over here for now. This thing is terrible at cutting down trees, though. I'm going to go cut down a tree because, well, I need the wood. I need it. Wood cutting skill to going to 23. I'm going to start just chopping down random trees over here. There we go. That's coming at me. Not the greatest way. Okay, right. Not the direction I was hoping it would go, but that's okay. That's okay. Killing serpents. Play Baldy and put at least 100. No, 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 no. I will... If someone, th this was the deal. If someone donates me a hundred thousand dollars, I will play Baldy. What was the original deal? Wasn't all day, was it? Hundred thousand dollars, I will play Baldy for 24 hours straight. That's the deal. I will stick by that. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. I do not endorse it. That is a terrible game. I can't stop you. For 20 bucks. I'm not playing for 20 bucks. That is not good money right there. That is a bad time. I won't tell you the max of the minimum amount that I play Baldi for. But it's actually higher than you think. It is higher than you think. Oh, he played Baldy for ten dollars now. Four out of ten. Four out of ten. My negative four out of ten, maybe. Oh, I've actually I've almost finished smelting all my metal. That's a good sign. Oh no, no, wait, no, wait. There's no, no it's just lies and slander. That's what that is. Lies and slander. That's a lot of rocks. All right, I guess we just wait. I guess we just wait. We got to go hunt some deer now, I guess. Because, you know, oh, speaking of deer, I see a deer. Oh, I don't have a bow and arrow. I don't have a bow. We could just do this the old fashioned way. Where was that? Where's that deer? Where did I see that deer? I know I saw a deer. I was standing right up here and I saw a deer. There it is. I see it. This deer. I don't have a bone arrow, but I'm going to smash this deer's face in with his mace. Oh, it's awesome. Take it. Let's get it gonna get trapped on the house I knew it got it there we go what about that one that one looks like it wants it too Have you seen how these things run they obviously are disabled I could run faster than it too 
Ah. Come here, dear. Come here, dear. Okay, fine. You'll be back, though, and I'm going to have a bow and arrow, and everybody's going to be really uh, proud of me. Because my bow and arrow is also there in the Land of Pirates. Bow and arrow is also in the Land of Pirates. I don't like the fact that my bow and arrow is over. Wait, how much How much do I spend? Let's like make, make a new bow and arrow. How much is bow and arrow? Where is crude bow? There is crude bow. Eight leather straps. I can do that. I think I have eight leather straps sitting around here somewhere. Somewhere, maybe. Or did I spend them all? Did I spend all my leather straps? Yeah, it's a small possibility I might have spent all my leather straps. I spent all my leather straps. I have three leather straps. I need to kill a bunch more boars. That's not great. Not great at all. At any rate, we're almost done with all this metal and I'll be able to have the basic foundation of building some stuff. When's the next stream? Um, I don't know. Maybe tomorrow, maybe the day after. You know, let me, let me think about it. Stay tuned. Oh, I actually have more honey than boar meat. That's nice. I like that. I like that. I think if I want to stream on Sunday. There we go. Got more metal. Got more metal for my. There we go. I don't know. I need more coal. I'll let you know. Stay tuned on the Discord. Drop that Discord link and the YouTube link. Why not pimp the crap out of everything? Bow and arrow equipped. It's coming right at us. 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 Right at us. Oh, got it. Hunting. Who needs a bow and arrow? Those are for suckers anyway. Besides, all my arrows are over there too. Stupid arrows. I think we actually got enough. We can... That's my puke berries over there. I don't like the puke berries. Oh, I got too much stuff now. I got too much stuff now. I'm going to eat this one last honey to make room for some of that. I know I'm carrying too much. Oh, I don't have room to make anything. Okay, let's throw one of these in here. Actually, no, let's place stacks. There we go. All right, good, good. Now I have room to make stuff. Time to make some bronze. All right. Yeah. I'm going to make... Oh, missing ingredients. Oh, I can make bronze plate carass. Bronze leggings. Let's do it. First of all, let's make a bunch of... More bronze. More bronze. Make all the bronze. Make all the bronze. Yes. All right. I'm going to make myself a bronze caress. And craft it. Oh, yes. New item. Apply that bronze. Oh, we're so shiny. How to make a bronze axe? What do we need for that? We need. Oh, we got all of it. Let's craft that too. Yes. All right, let's upgrade some stuff. What do we need to upgrade? Just bronze. Am I that far? I have one bronze left. One bronze. I have plenty of bronze. Give me more bronze. Oh, look at that bronze. People are like, look at all this bronze he doesn't have. Let's see. Bronze mace. Get upgraded. I'm, I, I need, a, need a level three. Aren't I level three? One, two, three. What, what do I need to make? Okay, whatever. Make bronze. Bronze axe. There we go. Let's do it. Bronze axe. Crunch. Bronze plate. 
That is some upgrade material right there. That is some upgraded material. I'm out of tin. Tragically out of tin. There we go. I think we've done it. One of these is going to be like the... This is going to... Oh, I still have more bronze. I still have copper ore. I forgot I put copper ore in there. That's fine. I'm out of tin anyway. All right, I'm going to put the... Uh, I'm going to put in there. Oh, yeah, I'm going to put my crap axe in there and my crap club in there. There we go. We did it all. We did it all. Now I can officially... Look at that. We're slightly more protected than we were before. Marginally more protected. We can actually chop this stuff up now. Look at that. My god. I can't hit this, but it's fine. No, I mean, look, we didn't even, like, lose anything on the island. It was mostly the fact that the crappy house was a, uh, was a uh, dilapidated barn that is now more dilapidated than it used to be. That's the thing. Now it is now it is actually more themed appropriately. Far more dilapidated than it was. And it's fine now. That's pretty much what all I can say about that. Architecture No no no, this is it's it's perfect. I think it's actually gained the respect of the architect community for uh, committing to the bit. We committed to the bit and now it's better. Doing? You you really want to just... Uh, exactly. That's exactly what everybody thought was going to happen. That's exactly what everybody thought was going to happen. And it happened. There's a rock. Eat some bears. Just committing to the bit. Store some of these in here. Perfectio. All right. All right. It's perfect. The house expansion is pretty nice, too. As you can see, it looks like it's it's got some off-kilter stuff, but we call that balance. So all things should be. All things should be. Oh, we, got, we got ourselves some... Crap. Just going to take a nap. That's how we gotta do it. Just take a nap. <clears throat> yeah. Anyway. I'll pimp my stuff again. Invent a better haircut. This is the top of the food pyramid of, of, of haircuts. That's what it is. Anyway, there's my two additional channels. I have the Discord, which you want all the information on when to when I stream. You can go and follow that. No pressure. The door thing, completely ignored. That was a paid actor. Fake news. And, uh, yeah, the YouTube channel if you just want to watch some clips. Not on Twitch. <laughs> you can go there. Anyway, I'm going to go and play some stacks. This is the greatest button of all time. Yep, look at that. Ooh, stacks are being placed. Get stacked. Get stacked. Multiple sets of rag stuff. More rocks, more rocks. I have enough to actually keep the puke berries now. Worthless. Worthless. Hey, all right. You can actually kind of like organize stuff now. Where's my... There it is. Pants. Meat. Food. Got a lot of meat. A lot of meat. A ton of meat. That's a lot of meat. Anyway. Anyway, I think we're about done for today. I got things to see and people to do, as they say. So let me go and save real quick. 
take off and see if we can find someone to raid. As you do. Because everybody loves a giant thumb raid. Alright, anyway. Let's see who wants it. Two hour production? Yeah, that sounds good. He's uh, streaming software and game development. Ooh, Game Done Quick is playing Paper Mario. You know what? Let's uh, Game Done Quick. Paper Mario. Let's watch some of that. Let's watch some of that. We haven't done that for a while. Anyway. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'll be back maybe tomorrow. I'm not sure. If it is, I'll let you know up on the Discord, which you can follow by clicking the link right there, right, right to the side in the chat window. You can click that and join it. I may. I think I probably will. I do enjoy this game quite a bit. If I do, it's going to be 3.30 p.m. U.S. Eastern Time. Anyway, before I go, I just want to say thank you so much for the subs. And most importantly, thank you for being here because you guys are amazing and you make the stream amazing. So thank you. I really do mean that. Anyway, see you guys later. As always, my dude, thanks. You joined Discord too? All right. Thank you, Senna. Anyway, thank you so much for watching today. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye. 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 Bye. -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye.